Hello you guys, welcome back to another video. We're gonna do a quick little back to school haul today. Um, I've been working on this over the last, I don't know, week or so, and we just finished shopping. We actually did not have to get as much this year as we have in years past, so we love that. But this is everything that we got. So we just got back from shoe shopping and getting a few clothes for Brayden. So Berkeley actually just had a birthday uh, a few weeks ago and she got a bunch of new clothes and then also our old neighbor actually just moved away but um, gave Berkeley a ton of clothes, hand-me-downs, but they were like a ton of them still had tags and stuff so Berkeley's closet is full, her dresser's full, she did not need any new school clothes at all and Brody also has a birthday coming up very soon same same sort of thing so they did not need any new clothes nor did they want to go shopping for new clothes because their closets are full and Braden just needed a couple of things so uh, we'll start with what we got today and then we'll go into like the school supplies so we went to Dick's and shoe carnival today I'm gonna move these chairs out of the way or at least that one's a little more room but um, Braden picked out a few things at Dick's he's a very simple guy He's a lot like his dad as far as the colors he likes to wear and things that he likes. So it's all like very neutral, blacks, whites, grays. Um, he just picked out one pair of shorts. He also has a ton of clothes that are in perfect, perfectly good school wearing condition. So we did not have to go all out and buy an entire new wardrobe. Um, but he just picked out these Nike Totality shorts. They're the seven inch inseam which he's in men's clothes now so we are out of the kids section so that means clothes are even more expensive now but got a pair of nike shorts and then three nike shirts that are all pretty much the same just different colors so we got the white one that has the red and black logo and they're like embroidered on there and then you got the gray one with the black on black and then he also got the black shirt with the white and the gray embroidered Nike on there and then he got this Under Armour shirt which Donnie has this exact same shirt and wears it all the time but Braden saw it and wanted to match dad so he also got that one so four new shirts pair of shorts and then everything he's already got Berkeley and Brody are fully set already um, so all that was from Dick's and then the boys got these water bottles for fall baseball and then also for school to take water with them but they saw these prime hydration water bottles and had to have them they're actually they're only 10 bucks they're 9.99 they're 30 ounces um the squeeze bottles so they got those and then berkeley picked out this cup for her third grade cup to have it's this really pretty pink uh, 26 ounce Yeti Rambler with the flip flip top and the big handle so that's gonna be perfect for her and then for shoes we got all their shoes at shoe carnival which are better prices than like Dick's and Shields and stuff like that as far as I've seen so Brayden he picked out these Adidas they're like a I don't know like a woven material the bottom is white with like these speckles and so those are his new school sneakers he picked out all the kids have basket a big basket of shoes out in the garage but they all needed a new pair of just tennis shoes um, for school so berkeley picked out these vans for her sneakers this year they are black and then they have like the gray checkered back here and roses on them. I want these in my size. They're so freaking cute. Like I would 1000% wear these, but she wanted to do vans this year. So we went and looked at all the different vans they had and she figured she could wear these with like all of her outfits because they'll match pretty much everything. So she went with those and then Brody picked out these Nike Air Maxes. They're black, blue white gray and there is their shoes um, our school supplies i have not gone through and organized all the boys stuff yet because i have to like put their binders together 
Um, but I got their binders off of Amazon because we got school supplies at Target and they actually were out of this type of binder. And this is what the boys' school likes to have the kids use. Um, it just keeps everything together because they do have laptops that the school provides. And so these binders have like a laptop section on the front that's like separate from the actual binder. So, um, actually they're, they're both a little different. They're the same brand, they're a little different. Brody's is the blue one and it unzips like halfway and then you can stick your laptop in there and zip it up. And then you have like your actual compartment for all your stuff. So then we put dividers in there and then they have a section for each class and then they carry this binder with them to all their classes, backpacks stay in their lockers and whatnot. Um, Brayden is going into eighth grade, Brody's going into seventh grade. Berkeley's going into third grade. I don't know if I mentioned that. And then this is Braden's binder. Same style with like the laptop case, but his opens all the way. And then it's like a little Velcro to put the laptop in. And then he's got these little pockets and stuff. So we'll get those put together here in the next week before they head back to school. And so all their supplies are in these bags because I need to organize everything. But we've got um index cards they both got a compass and a protractor they needed black red and blue pins so we've got those um we have the pink erasers of course this is the lead refills for what are those called mechanical pencils we've got colored pencils there's another pack yeah, so this is the boys' stuff combined, so there's a, there's like two of everything, but those pens again, and then we've got some highlighters. Uh, we have white out. They both needed that. Here's that other compass and protractor, another thing of colored pencils, and then Brayden actually needed both sizes of the index cards, so he's got the 4x6 and, what are these, 4x6 and 3x5. And we got the Jumbo Glue Sticks, the Target, the Up and Up brand. I did a lot of that brand for the, you know, the Compass and Protractor Glue Sticks, Index Cards, that kind of stuff. Uh, we did Target brands. Same with the Mechanical Pencils. They both needed Mechanical Pencils. So we got the Up and Up brand of those. The Eraser. Um, I think it was Brayden's uh, grade needed Sharpies. They each needed a handheld pencil sharpener, also up and up brand. And then we've got the uh, another pack of highlighters here. Okay, they both got a pair of scissors, the student scissors up and up brand. And we've got a composition notebook in here. I know we've got multiple of those. We've got two packs of sharpened number two pencils, also the Target brand. And, oh, there's the other pencil sharpener. Both got just a standard ruler. And then here, one of the kids, I think Brayden, needed a binder, inch and a half binder, or an inch, an inch binder, graph paper. They both needed paper for their binders. And then I got them both a pack of the dividers to put in their zipper binders. And then we'll just put their class subjects here. And they have pockets in them too for all of their different classes. And then here's the last bag for the boys. They both needed earbuds, like the universal ones to plug into with their laptops. And these were, I want to say like $7. They're pretty, pretty good. And it has the microphone on them too and then i got them each a pencil pouch that has the holes in it to put into their zipper binders and they have all of this stuff in there ready to go there is the paper more paper actually i think the wide ruled one i think that's berkeley's i need to put that in her bag and then i don't know whose is whose as far as these go, I need to look at their grade list again and see whose is whose, but we've got a couple more composition notebooks. I just got all different colors, and then a couple
couple spiral notebooks. Also, the Up and Up brand. I got two different colors. That is all of the boys' stuff. I'm gonna set this aside because I do need to get all their stuff organized and put together for them. So, I'll probably work on that once I turn this camera off. And then Berkeley stuff, she actually went with me to do all the school supply shopping. So as soon as we got home, she was like ready to put all her stuff in her backpack. So this is her new backpack that she picked out. We got it at Target. Both of the boys wanted to use their backpacks that they used last year for school. So we didn't get a new backpack, which they didn't even really use their backpacks. It's mostly these binders for all of their stuff that they bring home every day. But this is the Jan Sport. It is so cute. Look at the print. I love it. So, Berkeley's supplies. We've got that wide ruled um, paper. And then she had to do a pencil box. So she picked out this like mint green one. And then in here we've got her scissors, crayons, and colored pencils for now. Until her teacher lets her know what, what else they want in there. Yeah, but she had to get some expo markers, so she picked out these colors, got some highlighters, the pink erasers, glue sticks, number two pencils. She had to do some watercolor paints, so she picked out those. And then she needed a two inch binder, so she picked this purple one. And then she also needed regular like the white school glue so we got the up and up brand of that she also needed the black red and blue pens so there's those a ruler and then a few more things in here she needed some markers so she picked these all different colors in there and then two composition notebooks so she picked blue and pink and then she needed two folders with pockets so she picked purple and pink so that is, I believe, all of her school supplies. Oh, and she needs headphones too, which she already has some, so we just need to stick them in the backpack. I'm gonna go get all this stuff organized and put away. But thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this quick little school supply haul, and I'll see you again in my next video. Bye.